Good day, everybody. I was going to go fishing today, but ended up getting real windy, so I took a little trip up to the place where the gold hides. As you can see, I just I didn't plan on it. I just took a over there, done a little scraping. I don't have much battery left in this camera, so it might go out. I had a, I had a little trench going over there. One over there from quite a while ago. Look, it's almost three years. Dig that far. Fill it in and come back and dig it up again later. Anyway, what I'm going to do, a tree. It wasn't uh, the best day in the world. I got some. Uh, well, this is the kind of. Kind of quartz you're looking for. There we go. That stuff right there. It's got a little gray color to it. Just pure white stuff. I, n I never ever find anything in that. But maybe one time I think I got a piece. It had three little nuggets in it. And that was the only time I've ever got anything out of that real white. This was good stuff too. This is just stuff I bring home and play around with it. This rusty stuff is real good. I think we'll show you in a second. A hedge. A couple little vines. You can't really see nothing in them. But there's a, there's a little speck of gold on that one. I believe there's a little speck in that too. Not much. But I did go. I've got my best specimen of the year. In that little hole over there. Probably my best specimen for quite a few years. Have a look at this guy. Pull that out. And a little nugget there. Turn it around this way. That thing. It's just chock full. Oh, full of it. Oh. Beautiful piece. And another back here. So that was my that was my good specimen for the day. I might just hang on to that fella. Maybe it might be Quite a bit inside of that too. We don't know. Uh, anyways, there's all little pieces of quartz you should just take home and crush up over the winter. And uh, a lot of that dirt I dig out of there. Take some bucket full of that down to the river there and pan it. You can uh, find some little nuggets in it once in a while. A little light in there in case they decide to stay all night. Had a big hole going over there, but I got some good pieces over there a few years back. That's a lot of, stuff, a lot of damn work. One going there, and I got one started there. I usually make a one big hole, and then I'll just go north, south, east, and west on it. I'll find one that uh, works. I'll find something. I might do a couple more minutes before I go home. It's getting late. I'll do a couple minutes in this one here. I did find some. Uh, I did find some chunks of quartz in here. 
sure we're going up down over that hill. There's a lot of uh, big pieces of quartz. But, uh, over the years, it's swampy down there and it sunk. So if you want to go down there and try and dig some out, you can't just pick it up off the ground anymore. That's not. We used to come down here 30 years ago and walk around. Just find this land that's all been picked up over the years. I imagine you can still find some if you look. Anyways, I'm gonna get ready to head her home. Looks like it's gonna start raining anytime. One bar left. There was a bear up here today. I didn't get a picture of him. Just stood there and looked at me for a few minutes. And then left. Just uh, right in between them trees. Come up and looked at me and then left. Uh, anyways, guys. <clears throat> at least I never got skunked. But, uh... Great piece of that is a great piece of ore. Yeah, if I'm better ones years ago, last couple of years this would be be a nice collectible. And it probably goes right through right through the other side by the look of it. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Catch you all later. Bye. See ya.